Hi, everybody. So we've all been deeply, deeply trained to ignore our bodies and live in our heads. We're thinking, we're looking, we're hearing, we're processing what we see and hear, but we do that out with ignoring our bodies. We jump out of our bodies and just live in our virtual reality. Now that's not what we're designed to do. We're designed to do what every other animal on the planet does, to live in our whole body virtually all the time, 99.9% .9 of the time. Animals that aren't completely distorted by being your pet live in their bodies, feel their bodies, and use all of their resources to respond to life. It's not that hard to come back. It's scary. It's scary to start listening to our bodies. We feel like, oh, I'm going to feel horrible. You know, I'm going to start crying. Maybe I'll be get out of control. You know, we have lots of ideas about what will happen when we're feeling our bodies. So I'm going to take the next two minutes, two, not four. <laughs> I'm going to take the next two minutes to just guide you in a little bit of what I call embodiment practice, practicing coming back into our bodies. So just feeling the sensations in your body right now. Noticing what you notice. Little bit of stretching wherever you want to stretch. Little bit of moving your spine. A little bit of letting go of your breath with a sigh if that appeals to you. Little bit of waking up your hands, letting your hands wake up your arms. Little bit of waking up your face, squeeze your face. Yawn, open, let go. Feeling your face wake up. Feeling your spine wake up. Find your lower body, your pelvis, your legs, and let that wiggle around a little bit, stretch a little bit, feel itself a little bit. <sighs> Letting go of your breath, just like I did. Letting go of controlling the breath. Mm. Just listening to your body, giving it permission to feel a little bit better, just a tiny bit better. <sighs> Stretching your neck, letting it move. <sighs> Stretching. Mm the front of your body, and the back of your body, rolling your shoulders, finding what your shoulders want to do, just feeling and noticing. Hmm. So that's been less than two minutes. Just keep going and notice as you do it, how do you feel? Do you feel a tiny bit better? Do you feel different? Do you feel the same? Did anything bad happen? Was it safe? So if it was safe and you feel a little better or you think you might feel a little better, then I invite you to listen to this video again, just two minutes in the middle of your workday when you're tired, when you feel 
muscle tension or whatever and just see if it helps just a little bit. Okay, thank you.